Hey, what's up everybody? I'm Super Sonic JV and welcome back to Persona 5 for the PlayStation 4. So, last time we uh, got some points up and, uh, well, we met the famous Detective Akechi. And, um, well, it went alright, I'll say that. Akechi didn't have exactly the nicest thing to say about the Phantom Thieves or anything. So, yeah, we did all that and now we're going to continue on. And, well, we're going to be doing a whole bunch in this episode. There's mainly going to be a bunch of cutscenes we're going to be watching since, um... Next two days, we're going to be pretty busy and everything. And then, um, we're going to go ahead and, uh, we'll get some points up and confidence, too. So, yeah, if you liked the video, make sure to hit that like button as you will out a lot. And comment, subscribe to my channel. Alright, I just want to say, before we actually fully get started, even though we're already started, like, my voice is a little scratchy today. And I've been coughing a lot lately. Um, I don't know, maybe it was Thanksgiving, the aftermath of Thanksgiving or something that kind of made me not feel well. I'm just going to say that. But yeah, sorry, I apologize if I cough too much in this video or anything, but we're gonna go ahead and study real quick. I say yeah, I should pr probably improve my knowledge. Now listen up. You won't have much time for studying when you go out into the world, so stay now while you can. All right, let's study. Make sure you All right, I'm heading home. I know, I'm, I'm gonna close up, dude, dude, don't worry. All right. Hey, hey. I see you're able to solve these problems quickly. I hope you're not just picking the easy ones. Well, all right, I hope I'm not. <laughs> Hopefully I'm not really. It seems you were able to get a lot of studying done. Oh yeah. I did. And point up in knowledge. Alright. Yep. Don't tire yourself out, you keep at it keep at this long. You should stop for today and get some sleep. <coughs> Excuse me. There's cough number one. Oh. Together at least. Oh, one of these. Were you watching the broadcast? The Phantom Thieves were the bad guys. Oh man, that just hurts my throat. I guess now that you mention it, I felt that way the whole time. Man, do you, will you people believe anything you see on TV? It's just brainwashing, isn't it? It really is self-centered. These people are the kind of people who believe anything they see on TV. <laughs> Don't do that, folks. Oh, we're up in the 18% rate. Nice. This has to be fake, oh, lol. Isn't it a crime? You're a crime, a nun. <laughs> Did you catch any of the student detective on the television yesterday? The Phantom Thieves are super lame. Wow, dude. Just, wow. The Phantom Thieves are super lame. Oh, and that talk show is simply dreadful. How can anyone seriously suggest supernatural beings are stealing people's hearts? That child is a phony. There's simply no way the Phantom Thieves exist. Wow. Unfortunately, my precious children all think they're real. And worse, this detective is amazing. Children are far too impressionable to see such vulgar content on TV. Come on. So people still don't believe we're real. I guess not. We're in the 18% clear rate. I mean, that's not too bad, but it's not very high at all. I'm so pumped. Right, so, I can't believe we are on TV yesterday with a catchy coon. It's like a dream come true. I can't believe a high schooler moonlights as a detective. He just like the detective prince. He's smart and handsome. He's almost too perfect. Yeah, he does feel like that. We have front row seats. I can practically reach out and touch a catchy coon. I was so nervous. Here is working that uniform without seeing like a seeming like a snob. He's supernatural at public speaking. I hear he's an orphan who grew up poor. It's part of what makes him amazing. He wants his last high school memory to be capturing the Phantom Thieves. This isn't a game to him. Says who? S oh, yeah, says who? See, I heard of the ads to the head of this. Some big financial co conglomerate. I will say, I love that he hates the media. Makes me believe that he doesn't do this for the fame. People say he's so good that he's made enemies in the police force. Oh, yeah, apparently yesterday's interview was so popular they're going to air it again tonight. Whoa. Again? They're gonna air it again? Whoa! Way past cool! Oh my god. Alright, Saturday. Remembered. I've been seeing a lot of this shows on TV about these phantom thieves of heart. Why someone would steal someone something like a heart which can, cannot be turned into money is beyond me. If I were a phantom thief, I wouldn't go after hearts or works of art. I'd go after gold. The value of gold has been high since ancient times. There has never been a more stable resource. You. Now then, sup, J. Bukesan? Oh, come on, lady, really? Can you imagine how much gold has been excavated by humanity over the course of the history? Um, three Olympic-sized pools? Correct. Thank you. 
surprisingly little, don't you think? That rarity is what drives its value. Yeah. Whoa, he actually knew that. Oh, duh. <laughs> Maybe I should ask if I can borrow his notes. Nice. Really, why would I need to know something like that? I'm just saying. Well, you must be really smart to be able to answer a question like that. I guess so. I'm alright. Alright, got another point up in knowledge. Alright. All right. Incidentally, they say that 60% of the world's gold is in Japan. What was your first thought? The Takugawa clan's buried gold? It's actually in discarded home electronics. In other words, a junkyard is more valuable than someone else's heart. What did you say? You can't measure the value of a treasure of money. A lot more guys like, what did you say? Who, what you say? <laughs> All right. <laughs> Man, that detective from yesterday really pissed me off. Was some kind of threat? Let's see. I guess so. If someone else could help him, we wouldn't be doing stuff as the Phantom Thieves to start with. Yeah, someone's gotta help him. Ow! <laughs> You're being way too loud. And he just slapped that in the back of the head. Cares? Everybody's talking about this stuff, anyways. Did what is she eating chips? Suspicious if we were whispering. Hey, you're really just gonna keep eating and eating and eating those things all by yourself? <laughs> Sorry, just ate the last one. Aww. These are too laid back. The police are getting involved now, you know. So you think it's true? We'll be okay if we keep doing this, right? Maybe. We can't let the cops scare us out of being phantom thieves. He's got a point. But what about that weird guy from Madarame's palace? Isn't there a lot we don't know? I mean, hey. That. <laughs> you three. Sorry, Reggie. Having so much fun. I'm a little jealous. I didn't mean to do that to you, Reggie. <laughs> Are you snooping on us again? You said before, Looks like it. I don't know nothing. Why do you think I'm here to question you? Could it be that you're hmm. hiding something? Never. My ears are always open to the troubles of my peers, you know. Oh my god. You're really that hungry for a good letter of recommendation? <sighs> of course you are. Nobody would take wow. your annoying job if they weren't. What's that supposed to mean? I have no idea. Student Council President, right? Wouldn't you have known about Kamoshida? Of course not. He honestly was a good teacher until that day. Until that day. Oh, but you always take the teacher's side. That's what a good council president does, right? Hmm. How about you? What did you do for your friend? You were much closer to her than I was. So how did you help? Hey, whoa. Any way to help? By myself, I couldn't do anything for her. Whoa. There's no need to shout. If those phantom thieves are out there helping people, I'd root for them, no questions asked. Yeah, that's what he said. Dependable than some people I know. Whoa. Just make sure you show up to your classes, all right? Man, you just got burned. You know what I asked earlier? about whether we'll be okay if we keep this up. I take it back. I'd be ashamed to let it end now. Hell yeah. It's about time we find our next target, too. Next target, huh? What's she doing now? I could. Could what? That's the question. Could what? All right, after school. Okay. Hey, you skate. are coming in at an alarming rate. However, negative ones seem to be more prominent. A crowd oh boy. with unknown goals that does whatever it wants in the name of justice. It's probably Good God. catchy. TV's got some crazy sway. True. It's free to deny our actions, but being cursed by his influence is another thing entirely. I mean, like what Reed just said, T TV like guides us a little bit. Like, you know, last episode we had the fact that, um,. People had black and white dreams until TV got in color and everything. That was so strange to learn about. Just when we were starting to get people to believe in us, too. 18%. What we gotta do is take down another hotshot, yeah? Well, Maybe. Do you have any ideas who this next hotshot could be? 
I don't know. Thing <laughs> yet. Damn it. This is really irritating. By the way, what's up with that luggage? Yeah, what is that? I decided to leave the school dorms. They were not only filthy, but too noisy as well. No true art could come from such a place. Oh, really? What are you gonna do then? You can't go back to that shack, right? I was planning on staying at Takamaki-san's. I mean, An's house. Oh. <laughs> I've even prepared a thank you gift. I hope it's to your parents' liking. Oh, boy. What? There's no way that's gonna happen. Impossible. You're the impossible one. <coughs> but it's another one. I spent everything I had on these delectable Japanese sweets. Oh. It's not the issue here. Seriously, though, what are we gonna do about him? Are you gonna sell? Oh, okay. Um. What about a manga cafe? I don't have the money. Then why'd you leave? Well, seeing as Yusuke is an important member of our team, I'll lend a hand. Oh, yeah? Come stay at our place. It's dirty, but at least you'll have somewhere to sleep. What? Really, Morgana? Call in the shots. Yeah, it's my Don't choice. You live in a cafe? I've been wondering about that for a while. Yonkin's not yes. too far, is it? Nope. And the cafe's only a minute walk from the station. Hmm. How about we go there now? We can have a party to celebrate Matarame's change of heart. Party, huh? Heck, that sounds cool. Good idea. We can make it a welcome party for Yusuke, too. <laughs> welcome, Yusuke. <laughs> it's decided. Sounds like a fun idea. Sorry to cause you trouble. By the way, I prefer sleeping on a futon. Well, I guess I can arrange something like that. <laughs> It'll be up to you to convince the chief. Okay, fine. <laughs> what did I just do? I'm like, we're gonna hold still. <laughs> oh my god. These loading screens. I cannot get enough of them. What a nice smell. Yep. This place looks so outdated. I can't say I hate it though. It's got like a homey feel to it. I'm gonna admit that. People refer to that as retro. Hmm. Mm. Who are they? My friends. A girl too? He's like, whoa, a girl too. Really helped us a lot lately. Yes, Josh has really helped us out a lot lately. She, yet she said this guy. <laughs> I bet you're the ones doing all the helping. No, really, he's been great. Huh. I've been their leader. Sit down. This round will be on the house. Sweet, thanks. You're helping though. Oh, oh, well, never mind. <laughs> Yeah, I got this. Wow, it's delicious. Hmm, indeed. There's great depth to its acidity. Well, thank you. Yeah, I remember now. I think I've seen LeBlanc mentioned in a magazine before. <laughs> that was a long time ago. Back in the day, huh? Oh, oh give me a taste. That was a little late, Ryuji. <laughs> Ooh. I hope I didn't make that. <laughs> Ryuji. Ah, it's so bitter. Oh, this has got to be cruel and unusual punishment. Dude, watch it. I didn't drink coffee when I was a kid either. Oh, yeah. I don't drink it either. Yeah. Go on and take him up to your room. No need to stay down here. I guess so. Ooh, I want to see. Okay, calm down. Only an attic. Yeah, it is. Oh, man. Ah, that bitter taste just won't leave my mouth. <laughs> Come on, Ryuji. Very much for the drink. You're welcome. Up these stairs. Oh, and uh, thanks for the soda. So you're uh. On, on Takamaki. Huh. Anchan, huh? It's a nice name. Are you trying to send me up there? Nope, never have either. Uh oh. Hey, you gotta get up here. This place is freaking insane. Go on. Are you trying to set me up? Thank you for the coffee. If you are, then bravo, man. <laughs> Thanks for the help. Back down here. I guess so. Hmm. Sweet girl. 
Yeah. Good waifu. <laughs> Alright, take your time. I know. What do you think of this room? I don't know where to begin. It seems quite ordinary to me. Eh. For real? It's a lot of dust flying around. <laughs> oh! See? A ain't this crazy? It's not bad. Than I thought it would be. What? I'll make sure to clean up. <laughs> well, sit wherever you'd like. Yeah. We're all over the news. Even those huh. who previously believed in us have been influenced by the comments made on TV. Wow, a catchy wow. Is that effing a catchy's fault. It is too. We don't want anyone hearing us. At this rate, we're just going to worry everyone instead of give them courage. Oh boy. To find a way to make our rightfulness known to society. It's time we think about our next move. You were planning on discussing that today, right? Me? Oh, oh, he. Okay, I don't know. We need to search for a candidate. It's not like we're just gonna stumble upon some important target, though. I don't know. You guys don't know anyone, do you? I mean, Yusuke de came to us and ga basically gave us the case of Madarame. I don't. Me neither. Hmm. What do you think, leader? Huh. Uh, what about the news? Well... There probably are a lot of famous targets on TV. However, yeah, I know. Suspects on the news are already being pursued by the police. Even if we make them confess their crimes, the police will take the credit. That won't do. I guess so. And we're gonna prove a catchy wrong at this rate. What huh? the? Sorry, I haven't eaten anything since. Oh, okay. And you spent all your money on that box of sweets? Come Dude, on. How much did you have? Anyway, we'll just have to sit tight until we can find another target. So. Let's eat something. How about that welcome party. <laughs> oh boy. Someone's excited. This music is nice. <laughs> I think I found something. Isn't that a portable stove? Can my we room? Put a pot on it? I guess. That sounds great. I've heard that eating hot pot together brings people closer. Hot pot, huh? Thing with meat's fine by me. <laughs> I only ask that we finish it off with porridge, extra parsley, of course. So, okay. What do you say? Fine by me. Okay, hot pot it is. Come on, let's go buy ingredients. All right, you guys do that. <laughs> Wonton wrappers and we'll take care of the shopping. Could you borrow a pot from downstairs while we're out? We can split the yes. later. Uh between you three, yes. But me, no. <laughs> I don't want to spend any money Welcome right now. Welcome party is going to turn out quite lively. We should go grab I guess so. pot and set up the portable stove too. We're kinda like so cute like that. <laughs> He's just <coughs> Oh man. More coughing. Oh, I gotta get over it. All right, but yeah, no, that's how I hold up. This is playing good now. Hmm, what she's supposed to talk to the chief bar of I, Yeah, I, I am. I am. Don't worry, Morgana. I got this. I got this right here. All right, we better talk to him first, actually. All right, so heard you're all having hot pot for dinner. Want to join us? Don't you know how busy I am? You guys go have fun. Her name was On, right? She's a nice girl. I'm telling you, he's trying to hook me up with her. Um, she is. You said your friend doesn't have anywhere to go. Asked if I could t take him in for a bit. Yes, she thought it'd be nice. It'd be too pitiful for you to ask since you're already freeload loading. Anyways, I should have a big pot somewhere around here. All right, um, yeah, let's go back here and look. It's the camera kind of pans out. I think it's a cabinet for kitchen supplies. Wonder if there's a suitable pot in here. Okay, take a look. You just crouch right there and just keep looking. Don't even bother getting anything like that. <laughs> I found an old earthware and vessel. It should be big enough. Huh. Ah, you found it. It's almost time for the others to get back from the shopping trip, so I'll leave you be. I'll be down here for a while, though. Just be careful with the fire, okay? Okay. Okay, dude. I gotcha. I'll be as careful as possible. And now, 
On to the hottest meet and greet segment of our show. After his huh. last appearance was so well received, we decided to bring back this fine gentleman today. It's the high school detective, Goro Akechi. Boo! <laughs> this tastes a bit bland. But I'm relieved. A lot's happened, but it seems your grades haven't dropped. <laughs> School's been going fine. I'm really sure it has. You, sis. Are you tired? You're probably lacking sodium. Do I seem so? Hmm. But hypothetically speaking, if these phantom thieves are real, I believe they should be tried in a court of law. That's oh boy. A statement. Are they committing crimes? Some people even say that the thieves are actually helping their victims abandon their evil ways. Yeah, that's what we're doing. What Madarame did truly was an unforgivable crime. However, they're taking the law into their own hands by judging him. It is far from justice. More it really is justice, though. Come on. Change a person's heart. I mean, who actually knew about it besides the peoples, but nobody would confess or anything. Is it a crime to manipulate someone's heart? Depending on the means, yes. He's absolutely right. Wow. Even if it makes someone admit their evil deeds and helps make them pay for their crimes? Why yeah, exactly. Honest? It's nothing. Do you believe that these allies of justice exist? Oh, of course not. Oh, boy. You need to think about such unnecessary things. You understand what I'm trying to say, right? Ooh. Study hard and go to a prestigious college. Moving up in the world is difficult as a woman, yet you can't do much if you don't have the authority. I'll use every this method is going all out. to make it happen. All you need to do is remain focused on what must be done now for your future's sake. Sorry. Oh, brother. Now. Yes. Mm hmm. It's fine. Oh. Oh, boy. Yes. What must be done? Justice. Justice. Thieves are out there helping people. I'd root for them, no questions asked. Yeah. What do I want to do? Yeah, you better decide on what you want to do there. You really should. You should have an idea, like, should I do the right thing, or should I try and turn them in? Oh, I can't eat another bite. Oh man, we just went right through that. That was delicious, Lady On. I'm sure you'll make a wonderful bride some. Oh. Uh, sorry. I'm gonna have to borrow the sofa. Oh wow. What you doing there? What's wrong, Yusuke? <laughs> we haven't finished our meal. What about the porridge? Or even udon? Just leave it for next time, man. Wow. He's got a point, though. She's asleep already? Yeah, how do you sleep like that, too? I wasn't tired. We should let her sleep. By the way, Ryuji, how do you know On? Yeah, Ryuji. Huh? Oh, we went to middle school together. Oh, yeah, that's right. <laughs> Duh. What was Lady On like back then? Not so different from now. Once we got to high school, we ended up in different classes and stopped talking. Until now. I don't think she had many friends. I mean, she grew up overseas. Plus, there's her looks. The popular kids hate her. The quiet ones stay away. Wow. I see. So, what about you two? Well, you already know my story. This is a oh, great maybe opportunity you don't. to get to know each other better. You know every detail of my past at this point. It's only fair you tell me every oh, detail boy. of yours. Mine? So you got nothing to lose, huh? All right, I'll tell you. It's just a normal story about a rotten kid, though. Who? My dad left when I was young. Ever since then, it's just been me and my mom. I yeah, I think I remember that. Tax scholarship so I can make things easier for her. Aw. I just screwed it all up. Turns out I'm a pretty bad son, huh? Come on, Ryuji, you're not a bad son. <laughs> Back when I was a first year, my mom got called out to school for me raising my hand at Kamoshida. Oh, man. All the teachers kept hounding her for what I did, but she just stayed quiet through it all. Wow. 
I'll never forget the look she had on her face, though. Oh, but Kamoshi was a jerk, though. On the way home, she, uh, she apologized to me for being a single mom and all. Wow. So that's what happened. They say at school that everyone is equal, but in reality, that's a gross oversimplification. I mean, he's got a point there. How you feel? Well, when it comes to getting labeled, nobody's got it worse than this guy. Yeah, than Josh. Is this about his past? Now that I think. Oh boy. We never have heard the details. All right. Well, it's gonna be tough on me, though. I tell you my story of what happened. Damn brat! I'll sue! Oh man, he's got like a bloody forehead and everything. If you keep this up, then I'll report about the money. Is that fine with you? All I have to say is that you did it on your own. And it's over. Oh my god. I just did as I was told. What? Do you think I am? A crazy guy? Hey, make this statement to the cops. Sorry, I meant a crazy, bald, drunk guy. <laughs> this kid suddenly attacked me. Got it? Wait, what? If you even try to say anything else, you know what'll happen to you, right? Say what now? Huh? But... Just fight it. Um... This is bullshit. <laughs> Shut up. You're done for. No way. You're gonna learn what happens when you cross me. I don't want to. Excuse me, folks. We received a complaint about an argument here. Is something the matter? Oh my god. Oh, it's you, sir. So what happened? Explain it to the good officer. Don't you dare. <sighs> don't do it, don't do it. I saved you for crying out loud. That young man suddenly attacked him. He shoved this gentleman to the ground. And this man got injured. You gotta be kidding me. It's as she says. Also, no. Make sure you deal with this so my name isn't mentioned at all. Oh my god. Then what that means, correct? Oh my god. Uh, yes, sir. So that's what happened. The full story on that day. Hey, cop him. No. Understood. Don't you dare. Why well, can't... Like, come on, you gotta hear my side of the story, too. How did I... How did I fail in court? Just I didn't have the money, probably. This is me off. God yeah. Damn it. Well, thank you for agreeing. Salt on your record just for that. Yep. The woman sounds quite horrible as well. She stayed quiet this whole time. Yep, yeah, you're right. That man is just the kind of person whose heart we should steal. Who is he? And where can we find him? Uh... I don't remember. You can't remember, huh? Well, it was at night, and I'm sure you were in shock after getting arrested. Oh, yeah. Can you imagine what my parents would be like that day? I understand all too well the pain of not being able to remember important details of your life. Oh, yeah. The victim's personal information is always kept secret. Identifying that man will prove difficult. Besides, the yeah. courts already made their ruling, didn't they? Even if How come he I... to give revenge, his past record won't go away. Yep. It won't. I can't stand it! He'll never go away. The world is so messed up! The 2017, Ryuji. ...while rotten adults get away with whatever they want! And those in power don't do anything to help the situation. Can't we fix this, though? Nobody would even know. Oh, boy. We just... Yeah, hopefully. ...true justice is. We'll make them come to their senses. Okay. Wait, Yusuke. That's gotta be what our powers are for. Sounds good to me. The flashier our missions are, the cooler we end up looking. Yeah, the cooler we end up looking with our victory animations and everything. You've all taught me so much. Thanks. What are you guys getting all excited about? I love how she just wakes up like that. Oh, sorry. Did we wake you up? Nah, not really. I've been up for a while now. What? 
Still, this weird feeling came over me while I was listening to you guys. It almost what? feels like I've known you all forever. Do you think I wouldn't go that far? Grounds are so similar. Hmm. It sure ain't because of anything good. Similar, huh? I'm the only one who doesn't fit in. Poor Morgana. Hmm? I don't have any past to look back on. No memories. Poor boy. We could search the whole world and we wouldn't find a bigger misfit than you. And the reason we're going to Mementos is to get your memories back, right? I'm sure your past will be just as troubled as ours. I mean, sure, he's been turned into a cat. Unless he is a, a full-time cat. <laughs> We'll see about that. Oh, people are upstairs making noise right now. Oh my god. I actually feel like I've known Morgana for a really long time too. It's so strange. I mean, it's been a couple months. I can't really put it into words. Look, huh. I'm helping you guys out for my own sake. Don't get me wrong. If you don't get started, Okay, Morgana. Getting mementos won't be anything but a pipe dream. Oh, come on. That sure was a quick turnaround. One second you're depressed, the next you're acting all tough. Yep. Joking aside, let's take this seriously. We should go as far with it as we can. I want to punish those corrupt adults and give courage to people in trouble. All right. Only we can do that. Ha! You can say that again. Only we can do that. <laughs> Phantom thieves will surely help me grow, both as an artist and as a person. Of course. You're under my tutelage after all. There's nothing we can't accomplish. Well, I hope we can keep this up. We should be all right with you as our leader. Well, thank you. Leave it to me. Best leader ever. This late? How late? I guess now is a good time to call it for the night. Okay. That reminds me. The owner said you're free to crash here, Yusuke. That's very kind of him. Nice. Convinced him, didn't you? You go, Miss Older Dude Charmer. Oh my god. What kind of nickname is that? Yeah, you gotta come up with something better now. I won't be able to sleep unless I take a bath. Take a bath? There's a house nearby, so you can go there. I won't be able to join you, though. I mean, you're a cat, and I understand. I wanna come too. How about you, Juan? You guys go on ahead. I should get going. Well, All right. Morgana. Good night, Morgana. What about us? <laughs> Damn it. I need to turn back into a human soon. I can't let her get taken by someone else. You better move here, dude. Either me or Yuji's gonna take her. <laughs> oh, a huge it's that old man. <laughs> are the best. On's missing out. But this time he's not facing towards the camera trying to give you the most creepy look ever. It's a bit hot, though. I mean, it's a hot tub. Old guys like it hot for some reason. I'm sure he'll stop eventually. <laughs> you know, I've been wondering for a while now. But what do you what? think about on uh, as a girl? I mean, um, uh, she's breathtaking. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you straight up said it. Well, yep, I did. Her looks totally make up for her overbearing personality. Ooh. <laughs> I'll be sure to share what you've said with On. No. <laughs> oh, please don't. Seriously? That aside, we need to hurry and find our next target. I hope he is joking. About that, though, is targeting famous people enough? Seeing people's reactions these days has been making me think twice about what we do. Oh, yeah? Pursuing only what's best in the short term may end up becoming fruitless for us. We need a strategy hmm. to appeal to the public. Oh? Well, what do you got in mind? Do I look like someone who could come up with such a thing? Oh boy. I was an idiot for asking. I'm more like come on, Rigi. Commander, and Morgana's a specialist of that world. Hmm. Hmm. Still. Ah, it's freaking hot! <laughs> How much do you have to add until you're satisfied, Gramps? <laughs> I can't stand it anymore! Oh, he lost it. Let's meet up again early next week. I'll, uh, I'll contact everyone. Oh, wow. Hope we're in swimsuits and not naked. <laughs> I 
I think... Well, I don't know what to say, really. Alright, so, yeah, we got a new roommate. Yusuke's with us now. Did something uh, happen? going to sleep yet? I'm, we'll be fine here. I see my see you on occasion, so this is luxurious and, and what, whatever. Oh. Should you give it some plant nutrients by now? You know, let's do it. Go ahead and add some nutrients to our little plant friend here. There is some reasonable price in nutrients. This ought to bring a bit of life back to the plant. Yes, it should. And point up in kindness. All right. That should do it for a while. Yeah, you're right. All right. So we have to go to bed because that's our only choice. You don't worry about breakfast for me tomorrow. I'll be finding some grilled fish and miso soup. Dude, I didn't ask you a single thing of what you wanted for breakfast tomorrow. Oh, we're going to the mementos. Or the velvet room, I should say. Mementos is uh, for when we're trying to capture people's hearts, but they're not as bad as people have castles. I'm back. I'm back, everybody. How you guys doing today? The prisoner has returned. Josh Sup JB has returned. You're in the presence of our master. Stand up straight. I am standing up, kind of straight. You have reeled in are quite intriguing. Oh yeah? In other words, they all have been unfairly labeled by society and are standing up against such fates. Have you noticed? Well, that's good. Your heart seems to inspire theirs. Well, that's what I'm trying to do. Be their leader. Outcasts of society. In other words, you're picaresque. Deepen your bonds with them. Those will become okay. the strength behind your rehabilitation. I look forward to it. I shall grant you an ability befitting of your newfound growth. Consider it a gift. A gift, huh? You continue devoting yourself to further rehabilitation. I'm feeling my bond. Igor's growing deeper. Oh, that's what it is, huh? This music, though. Oh, I got cut off. There we go. Rank 5 with Igor, Prison Master. All right. It's almost time. To wake up. Yep, there's my alarm right now. It's not playing D G Donkey Kong. Okay, now, now that's Kyle's alarm. <laughs> All right, but here we go. Sunday. It's the twelfth now. Are the Phantom Thieves just, just what? Still in the eighteen percent rate there. Oh, what's happening now? Oh, it's you again. Sai San's younger sister, correct? May I talk Akechi. to you for a moment? Is it about the Phantom Thieves, Akechi Kun? You are quite perceptive. I was wondering oh my if there God. any points in common between Kamoshida's and Madarame's cases. And how would she know? Victims, after all. The Phantom Thieves need to be pursued. Oh, come on. I criticize the Phantom Thieves, yet you don't doubt their actual existence. Oh, you saw that show on TV. Who didn't? can get in the way at times when pursuing the truth. Many details become logical if I think on the premise that they do exist. They do exist. Because my sister told you to do so? Huh. It was just a coincidence. Why do I get the feeling that you're enjoying this? He really is, because he's smiling. <laughs> you may be right. Huh? She's like, huh? <laughs> thieves that use calling cards and succeed in their crime? As the so-called charismatic detective, it'd be hard for me not to see them as my rival. Wow. Such high self-esteem. So the he does for some reason. And you are just. Yeah. What are you? People who manipulate others' hearts as they see fit. I believe I'm on the side of justice. Oh boy. I'm only using my natural-born talents for the sake of serving the world. Oh, Kikechi, come on. The same about yourself, too? I... Huh. Oh, that's surprising. So, you're just the good girl type of pushover. Oh. Oh, looks like it's starting soon. See you later. Give Sai-san my regards. Okay. Man, this guy is weird. Everyone get on my case. I don't know. Don't talk with people, okay? <laughs> oh yeah, you're a student council president, so. Oh yeah, oh he's not. Is he going to school? It's a delight to enjoy coffee of this quality. It is daytime. You'd stay until you find a place, you know. I can't promise it'd be comfortable here, though. 
Oh, that's pretty nice. But I'll return to the dorms. I realized something after talking with everyone last night. What? Perhaps it's due to my upbringing, but I don't know anything of the world, let alone other people. So you're going back to the dorms. Good. In my art. I need to learn more about them. I must interact with them more. Yeah, make friends. Turn to the dorms and start over by talking with the people closest to me. Ah. See. Good on you for realizing that yourself. There's no need to exaggerate. May I come again sometime to enjoy your coffee? My doors are always open. Oh, that's nice He's of him. Been through a lot too from what I've heard. Oh yeah. Related to him. No. Oh, uh, how would I describe it? We're just acquaintances, not family or anything. We're like family. I may be overstepping my bounds, but why did you decide to take him in? Yep, why? My reason, huh? <laughs> Probably because he reminds me of my old self. Oh, really? That's all. It doesn't take much when someone takes consideration on someone else. Your art huh. instructor, um, a former art instructor, he must have felt something for you, too. Besides just stealing your talents. Truth hmm. told, I cannot hate him from the depths of my heart, either. I should probably get going. Aww. Hey, you sure about this? The painting, I mean. It'd be a waste to keep here. Even if I kept it at the dorms, it'd only be met with skepticism. I doubt it would want that. Adding a hint okay. of color to an otherwise ordinary day. I'm sure my mother would have done the same. I see. I'll hold on to it for you then. Hmm. Thank you for the coffee. Like I said, I don't drink coffee, so... I'll come again. Well, see you soon. I mean, I'll see you soon, I'm sure. Or we'll text each other or something. Hey! You're finally awake. Well, thank you. I'm hungry. <laughs> That's the first thing you have to say. You guys sure do eat a lot. That reminds me, I haven't seen Yusuke around. He already went downstairs. Maybe. I right, go check. You are finally up. You know it's past noon. Oh, I could end up going back to his dorms. He left his painting before before he took off, though, supposedly to thank us for taking care of him. Don't sell it. <sighs> Don't be ridiculous. I never let go of beauty like this. This painting is amazing. Not only is the mother stunning, but the expression on her face. The regulars will probably freak out when they see it here. Still, I feel like I've seen it somewhere. It's a bit different from how I remember it, though. Huh. Hey. Well, if you're up for the day, go on and get dressed. I opened shop hours ago, so go take take the cat out somewhere. Okay, if you say so. Yeah, we got a day off and everything since it's Sunday and all. Oh, what, what's this message? Why are you texting me? Okay, thank you again for letting me stay the night. Apologize for leaving so quietly, but your rest seemed peaceful. After a great deal of inner struggle, I have decided to return to dormitories. Furthermore, I entrusted the priority to your protector, so Jiro. This painting should no longer exist in reality, but it is truly what my mother painted. I am simply satisfied that we were able to obtain it. And it was all because of you guys. I cannot thank you enough. P.S. I still believe porridge is the best way to end up. Oh, come on. We've been over this. Porridge is good and all, but come on. We were too full after we ate that hot pot. So calm down, Yusuke. Calm down. Hey, hey. Right, so you stay at home, huh? Okay, well, guess that's best. What now? Yeah, I just checked the fan site. There's some kind of threat on here looking about in the burglar season, the Phantom Thieves name. Sounds pretty lame to me. Oh, I saw that too. They're target restaurants, right? I actually found a really interesting post on here. It really has started, has suddenly started acting violent towards everyone. I might end up getting killed at this rate. I wonder if it's because he got caught up in all those weird people in Shibuya. You think he means those burglars when he's talking about them? Weird people. Maybe soon to assume that. Post said he started spending a bunch of money lately too. Isn't that kind of suspicious? I wonder how much burglar groups there are at in Shibuya. Damn, there's, things are really starting to get serious. Let's look into it. I thought you said that. Anyways, how exactly are we going about this investigating? We'll go to Shibuya in the middle of the night and catch him red, all red-handed. No way, the police will totally nab us we're out that late. 
Plus, if we were be, if we would be bad and the chief knew you were out in the middle of the night, mm, they target restaurants. Aha, what if we drew them to LeBlanc? What? Hmm. Uh, there's no way. Who would go out there shot like this? Wouldn't that cause a lot of trouble for boss? Hmm. LeBlanc targeted? It seems like a viable plan. Wait, wait boss, is that me? <laughs> yeah. That's a horrible idea. Yep. I mean, you get kicked out out of LeBlanc if we are. Oh, I suppose I left the Sayori there as well. I'd forgotten. How'd you forget something that important? Either way. I don't really want more thieves to be posting as posing us in the future. I wish there was some way we could make an example of those ones. At the moment, our lack of info means we just have to wait. We can continue searching for more information whenever possible, though. Yeah, I'm gonna try looking for stuff too. All right, so hey, shouldn't you tell the others about what Mishima told you? Yeah, I'll do that. But first, we gotta go ahead over to our good place the underground walkway and since it's sunday and you know what that means when it's sunday we gotta get one of these drink thingies over here so let's go over here and purchase a drink here we also got two text messages here how come would you like some fresh fruit juice and today is sunday i also have an og for sale all right so i guess i'll take it then give me five thousand yen that's pretty expensive though it really is but we're gonna get a point up anyway so it's quite a color i would not want to drink that i'm gonna anyways nice chugging that's how you do it Good job, I was watching you try so hard. Well, thank you. Thank you for watching me. Like that lady was watching me right there. There we go, we got a point up in knowledge. All right. right. Why in knowledge? I don't know. Okay, now you're healthy, let's go somewhere else. Yeah, I guess so. Wait, what are these texts supposed to be about? All right, so checking up. Yeah, a bunch of stuff. All right, we're gonna go ahead and, and go to Unground Mall now. And we're gonna spend some time with On. Because we want to, but first I kind of want to save real quick. Just want to save real quick. Because, uh, well, we still haven't had that confident with uh, Ryuji happen, like with the guy going drinking and everything. And, oh, Josh, are you here to shop today, too? <coughs> oh my god, my throat. I'm so sorry, guys. I've been thinking about going to see Shio in the hospital. If we could maybe spend some time together before I go. I feel like Bond with Ahn will grow stronger soon. So, what do you think? Will you spend time with Ahn? Hang out with Ahn. Thanks! Thanks! Oh, she said it for me. Um, what should I get for Shio? It's hard deciding by myself. Oh, let's find something together then. That's the best option, right? For real? Hey, I have some, hey, I have some big news. A double cream from that famous crepe shop is half off right now. Okay, go ahead and buy some. Oh, but I probably can't take a crepe in the hospital, huh? I really want one though. Do you think maybe Shio would want one too? Maybe. In that case, I'll buy two. I guess she might have rehab today too. They probably wouldn't even let her eat it. Um. Oh yeah, I forgot to mention. She has started her physical re rehab. She puts it up ahead of schedule. Oh, thank oh, nice. I think it's because I told her about how I want to get stronger. She said she was gonna start working hard too. I haven't actually seen any of her rehab sessions yet though. Oh, hold on. Who is it? What now? Huh? That's not good. What? Sorry. Sorry, something just came up. That was from my agency. One of my models didn't show up for a magazine shoot they're doing. They're looking to wrap, wrap soon, so I'm gonna head over there now to fill in. Oh. It's pretty close though. Wanna come with, with? Actually, let's go. I'll race you there. What? I have to race you on. Come on. Did I win? <laughs> we arrived at the meeting point. A spot. We said they're having a pre-shoot briefing. On senpai, I'm so pumped to get to work with you today. After I saw you in last year's show, I just... Oh, I think I'm gonna cry. Okay. All right. Um, it really wasn't a big deal. That fashion show was tiny. By the way, I'm Mika. And please, no honor honorifics. I might be older, but you have loads more experience on senpai. Alright, Mika. Haha, <laughs> it feels a little weird saying it like that. Oh, and you don't need to use Senpai with me. Anyway, uh, it's nice to meet you. Likewise, Anchan. <laughs> You're so nice. Something seems wrong about her. Hey, can you teach me how to be a better model? You know, your everyday routines, stretches. Huh? Routines? You mean like singing in the shower? <laughs> yes. Uh oh, is that all you do? Then what kind of stuff do you eat? I've been looking all over her place to import some org organic green almonds. Also, I'm getting super tired of eating 
tackle that. Do I need to, like, boil it in hard water or something? Mm -hmm. Um, almonds? I only eat, ever eat those when they're covered in chocolate. <laughs> and hard water, isn't that kind of tough to boil ice? I... Do you weigh yourself? Oh, of course. Once a year for the health ex examinations at school. Oh boy. So you're gonna keep it all a secret from me, huh? I get, I get it. I guess it's hard trusting someone you just met. Oh. That's not it. I just don't really think about that stuff. I gotta understand that. It has nothing to do with not trusting you. It's more than modeling is like a hobby for me. What? Huh? On Senpai. That's so horrible. What do you mean you don't care about modeling for these guys? You said that, Anchan? Wait, I... No, she never said that. I love this magazine. Everyone tries so hard to make sure that their product is the best. So she said it's a, it's a hobby for her. That is not saying at all that she does not like modeling. Mika-chan, just calm down. So we all know about your giving it all, your, all, all here. Okay, whatever. But you guys work so much harder than me. I'm still the one getting confronted. Wait! H hold on! Anchan, the truth is, we had both you and Mika-chan come down as sub substitutes for our missing model. I wanted both of you to cover, but if you're not really interested... Hey, I didn't... Don't worry, I I can do it alone. I read the concept docs on my way here. Hey. What? what? You faker! You're so mean, Anchan. Do you really hate me that much? Yeah, I knew she was fake. Keep it civil, you two. Anyways, you good to go, Mika-chan? Sorry about this, Anchan. We won't be needing you today. We'll reimburse your transportation expenses, though. We even throw in a little extra for your trouble. What? Oh. What? Oh. Magazine start left. Staff left for the photo shoot. <sighs> I really screwed that up. You're outmatched. Yeah. Maybe it's because deep down I'm not actually that invested in modeling. She sees straight through that. <sighs> Anyways, I totally ruined the shoot. Aww. But still, wasn't Mika's fate, fate crying pretty incredible? It had grace. I wouldn't say I wouldn't say the second one. I mean, that w that's what I'm missing. I don't know, though. I think I'm pretty good at fake crying myself. I know the perfect technique. So how do you do it? Listen carefully. I better listen here. The key is, you don't actually cry. I mean, that's why it's fake. Yes! Either way, I think you'll be able to use that ability to our advantage in the metaverse. I'll turn my failure t t today into positive energy going forward. I sense a heightened motivation from on. Yes, I do too. Even though we're technically the same person in the game and everything. So, there we go. Look, rank 5 with on. Alright. See crocodile tears? <laughs> Speaking of the metaverse, I'm going to try super hard in my work with the Phantom Beast too. But for now, I should go stop and see Shio at the hospital. Thanks for today. You're welcome. Bye. Bye. Oh, she said it for me. Whatever. Alright, so. Yeah, there we go. I wonder if anyone's gonna text me. Uh, yep, I thought so. What's happening now? So, what do you want to do about our next big target? Well, that's sudden. Right there, what that guy said, sitting around doing nothing, just pisses me off. You're talking about a catchy coon, right? I know how you feel. How uh, that high school detective? He'd have to shut up if we change another person's heart. Perhaps. Definitely. But he did mention that the police are starting to mobilize. Either way, I don't think we should leave a catchy coon be. This is a perfect time to meet and discuss what our strategy should be going forward. Let's scatter the hideout tomorrow. I guess so, but yeah, guys, we're going to stop the episode there. Um, yeah, well, thank you all for watching. Hit that like button and comment subscribe to my channel. All right, until next time. Bye, guys.